Molten steel transportation from blast furnace to boff or EF by locomotive train. The pouring station has an operator who weighs and pours and an assistant who plugs in electric power to tilt the torpedo and moves the train locally and changes the torpedo at the pouring station. Generally, it takes half of torpedo to fill the hot metal transfer ladle. The control room or operator's pulpit is equipped with controls for rotating the torpedo, operating the ladle transfer car, reading scales, taking temperatures, desulfurization equipment, and sending samples to a chemistry lab. The pouring operation, which generates considerable dust emissions, is accomplished under an enclosed hood equipped with an evacuation system and a baghouse. The dust generated at pouring, called kish, is mainly fine flaked graphite which precipitates from the carbon saturated metal as its temperature drops during pouring. After scrap is charged, liquid hot metal is charged into the furnace using the charging crane in the charging aisle. The ladle is tilted and the liquid hot metal is poured into the furnace. This process takes 1 to 5 minutes depending on the design of the furnace hood and shop fugitive emission systems. Some shops can charge quickly because the fume from pouring into the furnace is effectively collected by the hood and a closed roof monitor collection system. Other shops with less advanced fume collection systems, must pour rather slowly to minimize the heat and fume cloud, thus taking a lengthy 3 to 5 minutes to charge hot metal.
Thanks for watching. Please, subscribe and hit the like button.